Hi guys, it's Ludwig, this is SQL Bootcamp Online. So in today's video, I just wanted to share one insight with you that may turn upside down the way you're approaching SQL. So I would like you to stop learning SQL, right? Do not learn the language itself. I know it says it's called SQL for, for a reason. It's structured query langu language. Originally, it was called structured English query language. But right now, it's just structured query language. SQL, SQL, SQL. SQL, how you read it, uh, how you pronounce it, it doesn't really matter. But the thing is that if you're approaching SQL as a language that you need to know grammar of, that you need to know syntax of, that you need to know the vocabulary, that will be very hard because this is basically the very same thing as when you're learning the actual language. Let's say that you uh, live uh, in the US and you want to start learning German and you just go through the book, you learn the grammar, you learn all of the exceptions where Germans have way more exceptions than rules or so it seems. So you just start and, and learn everything there is to learn and you get bored and you get um, absolutely frustrated and you get disconnected from the idea that sparked the entire um, the entire process in the first place, right? So the thing is that if you're using something, if you're learning something that you're not using, you'll forget it sooner or later. So what I want you to learn instead, and that comes from, ex from the experience, from the seasoned uh, SQL consultant, because again, I'm um, uh, saying the same thing in every single introduction that I'm making that I have over 15 years uh, of uh, experience of, as SQL Server consultant, trainer and mentor to other trainers and consultants. Do not learn SQL itself. Learn problem solving. Learn answering the questions that the business will ask you to answer, right? So that's what you need to learn. What you need to do is you need to say, hey, how do I answer the question of XYZ and then find the right tool, right? And the right tool is the proper syntax, it's the proper vocabulary of the language that you will be using. That will be way easier. So do not try learning, all right, how do I group the data in SQL Server? How do I filter the data in SQL Server? How do I do this and that on SQL Server? Don't do that. It's not worth it. Go ahead and look at the, uh, at the simple database that you want to get used to. Get this database, start learning about the database by figuring out, okay, I do see the customers in here. I do see the uh, um, employees in here. How about finding every single employee that uh, has a manager? If I have everyone in just one table, isn't that kind of a difficult thing to do, connect a table into the table itself in order to find out who's the manager of, uh, of who? That may be an interesting idea, right? And this way you're sparking again a, a, a question that you can learn to answer. And if you are learning by problem solving, that will be way easier for you. And this is why on all of my courses, including SQL Bootcamp Online, we always start with asking a question and then finding the right tool to answer that question. Because if you will learn how to answer those questions, how to solve those issues of your business, because that's the business who's paying your salary at the end of the, uh, of the month, this will be way easier and you will be a linchpin. You will be absolutely necessary for the business for them to solve their issues using your skill set, your knowledge and your problem solving approach, right? So again, this is exactly how the SQL Bootcamp Online is built. Do not learn SQL uh, in 2022. Learn problem solving using SQL and it will take your career to the very next level. So. Without further ado, just go to SQL Bootcamp online, sign up, and I'll see you on the other side.